COVID concerns and Thanksgiving travel. Millions across the country hitting the road and the sky despite CDC warnings. Gio Benitez is at LaGuardia Airport here in New York with the latest. Welcome back, Gio. Hey, Eva, good morning again. Yeah, we just learned that just yesterday, TSA screened more than a million people here at TSA checkpoints across the country. That is the highest single day number since the start of the pandemic. This morning, more than 6 million people hitting the skies since last Friday for Thanksgiving. More than 50 million expected to travel by car and plane. Some airports packed despite that CDC warning to stay home. Some Americans, after enduring lockdowns for months, are looking for human connection this holiday season. Family is so important right now and having the support and being there for one another. We just really need this hope and this connection right now. But where are most people going? Not cities like New York or Los Angeles. Instead of people traveling to more major tourist destinations, we're seeing a lot of hometown cities start to rise in popularity. So places like Dallas, Philadelphia, Nashville are all topping the list this year compared to last year. TSA says the busiest airports right now, LAX, Orlando, and Hartsfield-Jackson in Atlanta. And the busiest travel day is still days away. Probably the busiest day of the entire weekend, not unusual for long weekends, uh, is going to be the Sunday, the return day. Yes, yeah, Sunday we could see even bigger numbers than yesterday. Now, when it comes to a vaccine, health officials say that we could see the first vaccinations in just about a month. What? People definitely hoping for that. All right, Gio, thank you so much. We appreciate it. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.